The WEI's AC was the first computer in Israel, and one of the first large-scale, stored program, electronic computers in the world. It was built at the Weizmann Institute during 1954-1955 based on the Institute for Advanced Study Architecture developed by John von Neumann. The WEI's AC was operational until December 29, 1963, and was superseded by a controlled data 1604A computer. The 1604A was later superseded by the locally designed Golem. As with all computers of its era, it was a one-of-a-kind machine that could not exchange programs with other computers. The beginning. The WEI's AC project was initiated by Professor Heimel Pekeris, who worked at the IAS at the time von Neumann's IAS machine was being designed. Heim Weizmann, Israel's future first president, asked Pekeris to establish the Department of Applied Mathematics at the Weizmann Institute, and Pekeris wanted to have a similar computer available there. Pekeris wanted it as means to solve Laplace's tidal equations for the Earth's oceans, and also for the benefit of the entire scientific community of Israel, including the Defense Ministry. In July 1947, an advisory committee for the Applied Mathematics Department discussed the plan to build the computer. Among the committee's members were Albert Einstein, who did not find the idea reasonable, and John von Neumann, who supported it. In one conversation, von Neumann was asked, what will that tiny country do with an electric computer? He responded, don't worry about that problem. If nobody else uses the computer, Pekeris will use it full time. In the end, a decision was made to proceed with the plan. Heim Weizmann assigned $50,000 for the project 20% of the Weizmann Institute total budget. In 1952, Gerald S. Dreen, a research engineer from the von Neumann project, was chosen to lead the project. He came to Israel along with his wife, Thelma, who was an electrical engineer and also involved in the project. They brought with them schematics, but no parts. Estrine later commented, As I look back now, if we had systematically laid out a detailed plan of execution we would probably have aborted the project after arriving. Estrin's impression was that, besides Pekeris, other Israeli scientists thought it is ridiculous to build a computer in Israel. To recruit skilled staff for the project, a newspaper advertisement was posted. Most of the applicants had no records of prior education because those were lost in the Holocaust or during immigration. But in Israel's budding technical community everyone knew or knew about everybody else. The WEI's AC project also provided an opportunity for mathematicians and engineers to move to Israel without sacrificing their professional careers. Specifications WEI's AC was an asynchronous computer operating on 40-bit words. Instructions consisted of 20 bits, an 8-bit instruction code and 12 bits for addressing. Punched paper tape was used for I.O., and later, in 1958, magnetic tape. The memory was initially a magnetic drum containing 1,024 words, and was later replaced with a faster 4,096-word memory. In 1961 the memory was further expanded with two additional 4,096 word modules. Usage In late 1955, WEI's AC performed its first calculation. Subsequently it was used to study problems like worldwide changes in tide, earthquakes, atomic spectroscopy, X-ray crystallography, random walk methods, numerical analysis and more. The computer found out that there was an amphidromic point in the South Atlantic at which the tide does not change. It also calculated the relationship between a helium nucleus and its two electrons and yielded results that were later experimentally confirmed by the Brookhaven National Laboratory. 
WEI's Air Day C was kept constantly busy, and users became increasingly frustrated with not being able to get computing time, and demanded more computers to become available. WEI's Air Day C's success led to the recognition of the demand for computers and digital technology in Israel, and ultimately, provided the foundation for Israel's computer and technology industries. Recognition On December 5, 2006, WEI's Air Day C was recognized by the IEEE as a milestone in the history of electrical engineering and computing, and the team who built it were awarded the WEI's Air Day C medal.